now I've hooked up all the wires. Um, I suggest starting with the shortest wires. So in this case, uh, these two, because later on, um, especially later on when you hook up a bunch of other wires, it'll be easier to do the short ones before you've added other ones that kind of go over and um, cover everything up. So I have here red at the top, black at the bottom, and these are all of these pins from the sonar sensor are lined up with the, the white housing. Um, you might have black housing, but that's okay. And I have the blue and yellow in the correct holes here. It's kind of hard to tell, but there's three open holes, then a yellow, then a blue. And down here I have red in one of the holes next to the red line and black in one of the holes next to the blue line. So those are all hooked up correctly. The next thing I'm going to do is plug in the USB cable. So every time I hook up more wires, I do it with the USB cable not plugged in, and then I plug in the USB cable. Now I'm going to go back to Arduino and click on open and go to B left sonar because of the wires that we just hooked up. And now I'm going to test them out by loading this code. So I'll hit the upload button. And now that it's done uploading, I will hit the serial monitor. And you can see here that we get numbers coming out. Um, and if I position the camera like this, uh, you can't really tell, but the numbers are, uh, they're about 2000 right now. But if I put my hand in front of the sonar sensor, then they drop down to like 600. Move it away and the numbers go back up to 2000 and put my hand in front. The important thing is that the numbers go down as I move my hand closer or as something is closer in front of the sonar sensor and they go up as, as something moves further away from the sonar sensor. And if you have all of that, then you've hooked up these wires correctly.